Hey guys, Jeremy Jacobus here. If you're new, welcome. If you're not new, welcome back. It's lovely seeing your beautiful faces. This is about my food adventures all over the world. And today we are going on a food adventure to a very, very special place. Uh, we're going to my hometown. So I grew up in Irvington, which is in Westchester County, which is just in the suburbs of New York City. It is about a 35 minute drive from where I am right now in Williamsburg, Brooklyn. Um, I've been sort of back and forth in my town a little bit since I left, like I'm speaking like when I was 18 and graduated. But my parents moved away a few years ago to a few towns over, so I really haven't been back at all. And I figured this was a fun excuse because my friend Dara Pollock uh, at Skinny Pig NYC has a few like social media clients at restaurants. And I was like, hey, next time you go, I'll come along. Let me like revisit my hometown and eat some amazing food. So we are gonna go to Sambal, which is a Thai restaurant, which I've never been to, and Chutney Masala, which is actually a place I grew up eating at in Irvington. And we're gonna go there, we're gonna eat some food, and I'm gonna reminisce and take you guys along for the ride. So Dara is meeting me downstairs, so let's uh let's go find her. Okie dokie. It's a wide lens, don't worry about it. <laughs> okay, I am putting in the Google Maps because I've driven here like six times and I still don't know the way really. Well, so. it is my hometown. I do know exactly how to get there, but what does Google Maps say? Yeah, Google Maps is saying the there's no, no traffic this way. This is the way it went last time. Uh, BQE to the RFK to the I-87 North, yeah. blah, blah, blah. All yeah, right, if there's no the traffic, way. that's the fastest, I agree. I'm just going to... I'm just gonna listen to her because if she doesn't talk to me, that bitch. I will never figure it out. All right, so, well, off we go. Off we go indeed. Yes. Seatbelt, safety first, Jeremy. I mean, how pretty is it here? It is so pretty. I was just thinking that with the trees and everything. I was like, wow. Oh, good. This song. Let me fucking kill myself. Kidding me? Just hand out the razors. Are you serious? Fuck. Wait, where am I going? Make a right. <laughs> So that's the middle school I went to. Oh, fun. That's not now. It's not a middle school anymore. It's like a four or five school because oh, they God. it kept like getting bigger and bigger. A school district. Right. Um, that used to be a, a baseball card store. That was oh, it used to be a video rental store and then a baseball card a store. Video rental store. Yeah, we used What's to that? we used to go in there and um, like at lunch and like shove like our friends into like the porn section. You know that fun joke, <laughs> and then get thrown out. <laughs> uh, that old chestnut. Mm. But it's such a cute little town, isn't it? I grew up here. I know Giordanes. You get a little sandwich. Yeah. So fancy. There's like a little like that was nothing. The whole time growing up here, there's nothing in that. There's you couldn't even. There, yeah, there was nothing there. And then yeah. like an ice cream shop went in there. I know, and I like it's like so cute. I drove. Well, what's the, what's interesting about Irvington yeah, is uh, that um, you're not allowed to have um, chain stores here. Oh really? No, it's a, it's a law. So the only chain they've ever let in is the gas station, because when the gas station closed down 30 years ago, like. Wow. There are no local gas stations anymore. <laughs> so they like had to That's vote and be like, okay, we'll let Shell into Irvington. But there's no Starbucks, there's no chains, there's literally nothing, uh, which is nice. That is interesting. Oh, those little, little tidbits. Those the what? Little tidbits. Yeah. That is a fun fact. And this whole area didn't exist when, I, like in high school it was built, mm. but um, there was nothing down here forever. It was just a baseball field. Interesting. Until yeah. like my senior year or something like that. Yep, parents were there the other night. And that's all. Alright, it is Westchester Day and we are with Jeremy. Hello. His hometown of Westchester. My hometown, well my hometown of Irvington. Irvington is in Westchester. Right, and we are going to Sambal, which is back here with a lovely day. Eating some Thai food. It's a perfect day. Perfect day. It's very, very warm. You only get this weather in Westchester, Dara. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it does not come from the <laughs> Do you want to know when the last time I was here at this restaurant was? Sure. Any guesses um, what the occasion would have been? Okay. Uh, birthday? No. Graduation? No, but getting closer. Okay. Bar mitzvah. 
How is that closer <laughs> than graduation? I don't know. <laughs> Just tell my us. My ten, five, ten, ten, ten-year high school reunion. Oh, really? Five-year high school reunion. I don't remember. Some, one of those. I'm That's so old that I can't remember which one's which. But yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. They do have a nice uh, space for that upstairs. It was upstairs. And the, yeah, exactly. You can take a gander if you want to do that. Memories. It's so beautiful. Why sit inside and we can sit outside. They have this really nice patio. So sit in the sun. As I said to Dar, too white anyway. So same. Get a tan. Pop the shirt off. <laughs> Okay, enough messing around. I am here to eat. So I popped into the kitchen to see how they make their beef patsy. Ooh. Oil is heated up in a wok before beef is added in. Whoa, a little fire is always necessary. Then comes an egg, which gets scrambled in. Chinese broccoli. The fresh noodles, a mixture of soy, sweet soy, and seasoning sauce is tossed in. And that's it. Let's play. All right, so when you get Thai food, one thing I always have to order is the Patsy Yu. It looks amazing, it smells amazing. I don't know, let's eat it. <laughs> I think it's two things for me. One, it's always the texture of these noodles. I love them. Mm. And two, I always just like the little tiny, tiny bit of sweetness in it. Not good, right? Yeah. Mmm. That's the thing I love about it too. Dara says she loves that too. I have a mic for this. <laughs> <laughs> We got some of these cauliflower things. That looks good. Dower's over there with some dumplings. Uh, all right, so off to the second stop? Yes, we are. Great. So, so before this is like a fancy parking lot for like all these restaurants and stuff. Mm -hmm. It's like where kids did drugs. Really? Yeah, because wow. there's nothing down here. Yeah, that makes sense. Learning lots of fun facts about <laughs> Westchester today. It's so crazy. I haven't been here. I've driven through town over the years, but I haven't actually like sat here in the middle of town. Uh, and mm, since I graduated, probably. So that was, I don't know, fucking 15 years ago or something. Um, it's fun to see what's changed and it's fun to see what hasn't changed. Um, just like even like, oh, there's a tool store that's been there before I lived here. Um, it's very pleasant, very nice. Even just like crossing the street. I, I wasn't even close to the crosswalk. Car stop. It's like, no, 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 go, go, go. Like, <laughs> it's very different than New York City. Um, but yeah, it is a, it's not humbleness of the word, but it is a, uh, there's a niceness to it. There's a niceness to the suburbs. There's a niceness to Irvington. There's a niceness to Westchester, which you forget sometimes, you know? Okay, so our second stop is Chutney Masala. What's funny is the first location we were at used to be Chutney Masala. So when I walked in, I was really confused on why we weren't there. But it's the same owner, but they switched locations. So a little bit up the street on Main Street is Chutney Masala, for Indian food. Um, and yeah, that's what we're gonna go eat now. Blowing up. Mm. Mm. It's, their doll is incredible. What is this that came out? It's a vegan? This uh, vegan, it's the T-H-A-L-I tali platter. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. Oh, it's so pretty. Cool. Rip and dip situation? Yeah, I'll help. There Into go. the what? What is this? Doll. D-A-L. I hope that's in focus. Mm. Mmm. Right? I made mm. little pieces of bread for you. <laughs> Uncle. Isn't it good? Mm-hmm. Oh, it's so buttery. This is mango chutney? Mm-hmm. 
I mean, if you call the restaurant that, ooh, you know what? That yeah. had like a kick like it's a, a kick. minute later. Yeah, it's a slow heat. Mm -hmm. It creeps up on you, but it is good. I love the food. Mm. It's funny, the number one question I get from my audience mm -hmm. is why I don't post more Indian food. Really? And it's not that I don't like it, I just find myself not eating I a lot. I love it. I forget how much I like it. It is heavy though. I feel like it's always a heavy meal, or I like the heavy mm -hmm. stuff. Mm. So if I'm eating it, I want all the heavy mm -hmm. stuff. Mm. You asked me for chicken and... Uh, Ooh. You put some stuff on top. Rich with nuts. And actually, it's not on my... It's only on available on chutney masala uh, online order. To go oh, down. okay. Not even in the restaurant. They can be given in the restaurant, but... Got it. When we started this, I haven't changed the menu since then. Okay. Oh, good. Yum. Mm. Whoa, well, look at the color in there. Right? It's so pretty. Let's see. Okay. Mmm. -hmm. Oh. Yeah. That's crazy good. Yeah. Cheese and potato dumplings. Wow. Mm -hmm. I love that texture. Right? It's Me like too. a pillow. It is like a pillow. So good. Delicious. <laughs> <laughs> that worked out well. Mm. Chicken. Mm-hmm. Mm. Super tender and juicy. Yeah. Okay, so mm -hmm. since we're in my hometown, we're not gonna go to my old house. My parents don't live there anymore, but I do think it's worth going to my parents' new house, which is just a, t a few towns over, to see my dog. I mean, you know, my mom's probably there too, but my yeah. dog is there. Yay! French dog honey. We get to see honey. <laughs> You're gonna surprise her. I'm sure she will love that because dogs can totally feel that emotion. Uh, yeah, we didn't tell her I was coming home, so <laughs> she will be surprised. So if we did make a right, that goes to my high school. I mean, we can, I don't care. No, I, no. no, no. <laughs> you I don't, don't care? I don't wanna go there. Uh, <laughs> but listen, God is just, the answer. Just in, in, yeah, well, that's not my high school. Although it wouldn't fucking shock me if my public school said that growing up. <laughs> I feel like you're not allowed to say that in public school. Mm, in our public <laughs> school, anything anything goes. That's so it's funny. interesting, Dara. Coming up on the right mm -hmm. is a. It's the first female, the first black female millionaire's home. Oh, isn't that cool? That's our okay. house right there. Oh, nice. Wow. Wow, that looks insane. Yeah. Wow. Don't what crash. Fuck? I'm trying not to. I that's mean, a crazy house, fine. right? And it stands out like yeah, from that. Yeah, I was built, just going to say, it does not it was fit in. built when all these other homes weren't here, so yeah. it made a lot more sense when they <laughs> built it. Do you know why the town is called Irvington? You know what's annoying is I actually do kind of know. Someone told me that. It's not I that forgot. hard. I forgot. Did someone named Irvington live here? Do you, Washington Irving, one of the pristine, uh, amazing American authors of all time, you're going to want to get a left lane here. Oh. Um, this middle lane, I mean. Um, yeah. This was, his home was just down the street there. Interesting, but what about Tarrytown? So now we're gonna get to Tarrytown. So the origin of the word Tarrytown is actually a little confusing. Okay. Um, they believe it has something to do with like, the Terry people is like an old slang for thing, like New York, like- Terry um, Oh, like, like the a- Terry, yeah. Like the, like, I'm trying to think of a good, what's a good example? Like. I how the Knicks were the Knickerbockers, yes, like that, right? Yes, hundred percent. It was yeah. something like that. Interesting. I don't think it was named after a person, but I forget. Mm. Okay, it's possible. I will believe it. All your other facts have been super, <laughs> super interesting, and I can't argue any of them. So I'm assuming that they're just all. I did it. Okay, we made it to my parents' house. Go find my dog. Go find honey. <laughs> Yay! Let's go visit. You hear her? Oh yes, I do. <laughs> I was like, no. Ferocious guard dog. <laughs> you I, might, I might just be open. No oh. keys to my parents' house. You don't have keys to your parents' house? No. I don't even Why? have a key to my house. <laughs> what? Why? I don't That's know. That's so weird. I don't live here. I've never I know, lived but, here. Yeah, but still, I feel like <sighs> I have I have a key to my dad's apartment. I have a key to my mom's house. I don't have to store, I guess. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> Duh. Hello. I was like, <gasps> there she is. There's my puppy. 
I was like, you don't know me. Hi. <laughs> Are you all right if I don't have a mask? I'm, I'm okay with Everyone's it if you are. Vaxxed. I'm double, vac I'm double vaccinated yeah, or fully, too, so. fully vaccinated. I'm a mess. Hi, puppy. No Hi, worries. Puppy. I'm Dara. Nice to Dara. meet you. I, you I was going to say, you've, you've probably seen me on stories. <laughs> Hi, puppy. Oh, she's so much bigger in person. Well, she's a lot bigger oh, now. She lives good. here. You're good. You're good. You're good. You're good. You're good. Oh, there, there it goes. There's the belly rubs again. <laughs> okay, well, we're almost back to BK. What was uh, what was what was your favorite thing we ate? And if you can't remember, just smell because <laughs> I the know. food's sitting I in the back seat say. and it's been there for a little bit. <laughs> mm, great questions. Uh, honestly, I mean, the Ped CU at Sambal is like one of my favorites. So there's that. Mm. Um, then I'm trying to, think. I mean, the dal at Chutney Masala, the lentils and the kidney beans with the clarified butter. I mean, how can you not like mm -hmm. anything with clarified butter? It's so <clears throat> good. Uh, the chicken was amazing too. Honestly, everything was great. The chicken was great. Yeah, I think the chicken was probably my favorite thing there. The yeah. Patsy you for sure, at the Thai place. Mm -hmm. It's been a good eating day and I got to, you know, Darren, they say you can never go home again, but I, <laughs> I sort of went home. I didn't I get to go to my home. <laughs> old home and I got to go to my parents' house and I got, to, I mean, honestly, the best part of the day was seeing Honey. Yeah, she's so fluffy and large. <laughs> she looks so small on a small she's screen going, on She's going to go on a diet eventually. She will, she'll be on a diet soon. <laughs> she needs her summer bod. Aww. She's in winter bod mode hot, still. Hot girl summer? <laughs> yeah, it's it, a hot girl summer for Honey. <laughs> <laughs> oh my 